Here's the candy bar. I'm not gonna eat it. If you can turn your TV in black and white here right now, if you don't like the colors of this, but just keep watching, because seriously, it gets better and better. And we're back, yes! Welcome back to Pick Me Up Scotty, and I'm Scotty, and check it out. Yeah, this video was brought to you by Zeiss. I kind of always wanted to say something like that. These are the three macro lenses I was telling you guys, so we can get some really beautiful, nice close-ups. This camera has like a really crappy lens on it. This one's actually pretty good. Let's try... Well, this one's an older one, Macro Planner. I think I said that right. We're gonna throw this one on that one over there, but we'll use these lenses for the close-up stuff and it should look a lot prettier. So I put the lens on there. Does it make a difference? Does it look a little bit prettier? So thank you guys so much. We're gonna save these two for the other shots when I do the close-up for the set. Last time you saw the unboxing video, I took this set home with me, brand new, but it's awesome. Like I built it so fast and I wanted to jump in front of the camera and just review it for you guys immediately because this is really, really cool. So this is Zingbo City Girl XB12001, shining in the best time. This is a university, yeah. 1,750 pieces. And okay, so I know the colors. It's really, really girly. It's kind of like Friends, like the Lego series. I don't own any Friends because first thing I do when I see it in the Lego store, it goes, that's the girl section. But you know, I just wanted to see what Zingbo is coming up with this year so I can do it for you guys. But no, this is actually really, really cool. Now, the only thing that's kind of different is the minifigures. I'll show those later in the video. But what makes this stand out is the guy who designed it. He's actually in the book. Check him out. Firas Mooner Abu Jaber. He's from Jordan. I'm sorry, I can't say the names right. But look at this photo of him. The most interesting part about this whole photo is that boombox in the corner back there. Look at the size of that boombox, that stereo. Are people still using that? Firas, I'm gonna tag you in this video. If you ever come across this video, if you're ever in China, just come over to Hong Kong, come to my office. I want to sit down with you and ask you how you even thought about this. Because actually some of the stuff inside is really, really dope. Before we really jump into it, let me just remind you that this is a series of six. Correction, it's actually a series of 12. And as of right now, only nine are available. I have the nine just to review for you guys. This is the biggest one. And of course I had to start with the biggest one first. So without further ado, let's jump into the front here of this one. Look at the size and length of this puppy. Now, cool thing is, it's kind of semi-modular, so the tops do come off. And check this out, if I just split this open, you can see already that it's in sections. We're gonna start from my right to your left, and we're gonna work our way this way. So this piece here on the side is actually pretty cool. I have really no complaints about it, except, you know, they have their loose windows. But that's just a known thing, both thing, so that's okay. I do like how they made the little awnings on the top of the windows, those look really cool. And I like the little garden. The garden is actually pretty sweet. It's just flowers and leaves. That alone makes it really, really cool. And one thing, this designer is insane. He uses the little flowers for everything in the set. And I really like that. He's totally thinking out of the box. Flowers, flower, flowers, 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 flowers. Pry the sucker off. This is my favorite room. I love this one. This one actually, for me, makes up for the whole set. I had a big grin on my face, but this is an art classroom and check this out. I actually think this is really cool. Like this is so awesome. Look at that. Loving every single bit of it. Except of course, no tiles on the floor. That's the only thing about the set. You know, I, I, I guess I'm getting used to it. You got three stands here. They all swivel. That is so cool. Look at that. You know, and the teacher can kind of watch them what they're doing. You can stand the figures in there. The detail, I love the colors. These are stickers, by the way. You know what, they're okay, they're fine. They totally work okay. I just wish that you know they were printed. There's a couple on here, like this thing on the desk is actually a printed label. So I don't know why they just didn't print that. I guess it just saves money to make sticker. You have the canvas, the paint brushes. Dude, that is so cool. That's what, this is the stuff I really, really love, you know? You got the teacher's chair here, and you got a little flower pot, flower inside. And you got the little display case here in the curved window that you saw earlier with the little tree growing inside, which is just a bunch of branches stuck together. Very cool, I like it. I really, really enjoy this one. This one's probably my favorite room out of the whole university. It's just so colorful. How awesome is that? Now let's look at the floor above it. There we go, inside this one here. You know, you got the rooftop with a little solar panel thing going on. Does that look like a strawberry chocolate bar? When I was putting it together, I was like, man, I want a piece of chocolate. And you got the three flags along the top here. They're just, it's a nice touch, it's good. And you got two more windows here. The same design as you saw earlier. Another curved window here with a small plant inside. What room is this? Do you guys want to guess? Three, two, one. Okay, it's a chemistry biology room. Again, no tiles on the inside. I guess it's like not wide enough to put tiles in there, but still very, very cool. I love the details inside. How silly of me, I had the window the wrong way around. Let's just flip it while we're here. I don't know why I did it like that. 
You know, I keep looking at this and I can't figure out what that is on the side. I think there's a trophy there and it's on a display case saying we're the best university in Brickland. And here's the chemistry room. Look how cool that is. I love how they used a the scary face, minifigure face there. It's like a sample and they have a magnifying glass there. You have a sink. Yeah, this is really cool. This is like a little microscope on a little swivel. I like that. And on the back there, you got all the chemistry bottles and sets. That is so cool. The guy just flipped the wine glasses upside down. You know what? If you're gonna design your own thing, just take the idea from this. It's pretty cool. And then you got this chair here. And you got a danger sign back here on a door. That's printed, by the way. That's not a sticker. If you open it up, kind of hard to put the bottles inside there, but they kind of move around and shuffle around so it doesn't fit quite properly. Very cool. I like it quite a lot. Let's move on. So this is just the main entrance of the university. These two here, by the way, are stickers. I do like the, the design of this piece here. I think that's actually pretty cool. And then on the bottom here, you got some pretty flowers and a doorknob with a star on it. Again, it's a color thing. I know you guys are probably like, oh man, the colors are so weird on this thing. Is that the right color scheme? Do you guys like the colors? Let me know. With that being said, let's look on both sides. They're actually both just door, four doors because once you connect everything together, as you can see from the other set, you know, you have the door entrance to these two here and the other side too. Now, it, it's not much going on in here because it's just an entrance, but dude, check, dude, like really. No, but dude, seriously, look at the staircase. I love that staircase, man. That's that see-through piece the guy just put together and it's a staircase. I'm like, I love that idea. I think that's actually pretty sweet. No tiles on the bottom floor, but your staircase makes up for it. So Furus, is that your name, Firus? Furus. Furious, I like the bottom floor. There's just no tiles on there. And then it just goes upstairs, and then upstairs is just like, you know, a little small balcony that leads to the other two sides. Just in the way back there, there's two little trees. You can get to them, you know how? Like that. Yeah, because we are transforming this building. I don't know why I have to do that, but that's cool. You guys ready for the other two sides? I'm excited because they're pretty cool too. Here we go, we push this here to the side there. On the last two parts of this building, it's almost the same like the other one, except they use the gates here. You won't believe it. This is actually really genius. I don't know why I haven't seen this before. But look at that. Yeah, that's actually pretty sweet. I love this idea. The parking sign is really cool. It's printed, by the way. It's got the, a quote here that says, life is like moving to keep your balance. That makes sense. Anyway, so again, let's look at the first floor on the bottom. We're going to take this one off, which does come off. There you go. We put this aside. But check it out. Yeah, we got a classroom here. And all of this is printed, except for the top one. This is a sticker. It's like a design class, design art school. You got your stools there. You got tons of computers. You got the teacher's computer and the TV on the wall. Simple classroom, but hey, that's cool. I like it. It's not bad. Don't forget now, this is a university, so it's going to be a classroom. They could have just put like one computer and be like, oh, this is the, the classroom, but no. Very cool indeed. I like it. So let's just go to the last classroom bit of the university. Put the chair on the side. Boom. Now, there was one tiny mistake. I have two wrong pieces. But this is actually supposed to have a sign on it, a printed sign. And the back piece is brown. It's supposed to be white. But the sign actually says, time waits for no one. By the way, the clock is genius. It's just a wrench and like the faucet piece. And it looks like a clock. And you got this little parrot up here. Parrot or bird. Looks kind of weird. I've never seen it before. Actually, the rooftops can come off, see? It's kind of modular. So this side is just another classroom. I like it. I like how you have six tables, six chairs. Now, what's cool is the tables are actually using the faucet thing again. Guys, it's nuts, I'm telling you. It's and you have the blackboard here with a sticker on it. So yeah, it's just a classroom, but I think it's actually pretty cool. I mean, it's supposed to be what it is. And it didn't cheapen out and make it like, you know, one or two seats. I mean, it actually filled it up, and that's, to me, is pretty okay. And of course, it wouldn't be complete without something other sets don't dare to do. Well, some of the other sets. Check it out. Yeah, it's got a toilet, its own toilet for the university. I had a smile on my face when I put this together going, finally, you know what needed a toilet? You guys remember our favorite Sunshine Hotel? Well, check it out. There, I just did my first mock. The Sunshine Hotel now has a toilet that fits perfectly in place, look at that, look at that. There you go. Okay, so now we're looking back here at the toilet. Printed sign on the door. Boy, and it's a unisex toilet. Yeah, boys and girls can use this one. You got just a small little rooftop there with flowers on it. It's nothing really special. Top is kind of come off, and there's the toilet. It's a proper toilet. It looks pretty good, except there's no back wall on these sets, you know? So whoever's using the back toilet, I feel real sorry for you. Everyone's gonna see you on the pooper. Firas. Good job on the toilet.
And finally, they have something really, really, really small, but effective, and I like it. And that's this little park. I love the tree. It actually did pretty good. He just put the branch in there and then like more branches on top. Now this is something a little bit different. For the recycle bin here, I've never seen the lid, well, in different colors, but I've never seen it with the recycle icon on it. And it's actually printed. So there you go. Yeah, so there it is. University from Zingbo, City Girl, the new series for 2018. It's available on BreakMeUpScotty.com. I don't know how much, I don't know how much the shipping is going to be either. I can't really control the quantities and the pieces on this one. This one's kind of like brand new, you know how it is, but it's there. We'll help you guys get it if you want to get it. Whether you like it or not, I just want to be happy that you guys actually get to see this video. And I hope you can build it yourself and have one for your set. Does it go with the city? Do I have to pick up more cities? I'm so scared to drop something, but pick something up. Yeah, there's a diner with a pink and the pink. Do I have any other ones with pink on here? Not much pink, huh? This is the only other pink thing I have. I haven't done the review for it. I'm really sorry, guys. But this is your first look then at Oxford Vlogs Baskin Robbins food truck. Yeah. Cool, look at that. Does it go together? You guys like it? Pink City? And of course, it won't be complete without a figure, but these ones aren't really mini figures. They're more like the Friends ones. I don't know how close these are to them. Comes with all these. That's a lot of people, folks. Look at that. Oh, tons of little items and stuff like that. So you're gonna see all these guys on the spinning platform and they have their own names. So the next video, I'll name you guys. So starting with the boys, we have Aaron. His hair is different here on the box. Don't ask why. Then you got Myers, Michael Myers. Next to him, we got Betty ready to go on her scooter. Then we have Abigail. I do like how they can put sunglasses on the top, so that's cool. We can put ribbon or sunglasses up there. And we got Jewel, looking like stewardess, yeah. Senya in the red dress with a tie. Then we got Helen. And then we got Gracia. That's supposed to be Garcia. Gracia? Gracia? I've never heard of that name being pronounced that way. So her dress was missing a little piece there. It was red instead of blue. Oh well. Then we got Elena and the two twins, Ali and Peggy. And then we have Ols. I think that's an O. It's really weird on the print of the box. Ols with this O L S E. And next one is Della. And finally we have Natalia. So the minifigures come with a couple of accessories. There's a briefcases and purses. There's also a university book and two extra tiles, which looks like maybe more books. I have no idea what those are. Okay, so the set actually comes with a couple more things. One is like a cheap me type of vehicle. I'm not sure why it's here, but hey, it says university. It's got some pretty flowers along it. So it also comes with two bicycles that you see here and a park bench that can be placed anywhere. All right, so that was a lot of fun. I can't wait to review the other ones for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. So please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and I will catch you guys later. Until then, break me out. Boo! All right, I'm drinking more water. If I look like I'm all sweaty and about to pass out, there's a reason for that. We'll have it on camera. But anyway, talk to us more water. This is water, it's not vodka, it's just water. Did I already say welcome back to Pick Me Up Scotty? I'm Scotty. I totally forgot if I just did this now. Man, my brain's going on me, guys. I did one, well, I'll just, blah, 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 blah. I'll just do it one more time anyway. Ah, this room, this, yeah. Hope I don't drop this thing. Please don't fall. When to become one, I need some love like I need my soul. Dear, it's my turn to do this. You've been silenced. I'm gonna do it. I just wanna say thank you so much guys for supporting and liking the channel so much. I really, 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 really appreciate it. And now that we're gonna be growing a lot more, I can keep bringing you more content. So please subscribe on Deer Space. Check out some videos you may not have seen here. Check out some other videos over here. And even if you don't like Legos or bricks, hey, I just got into this. So it's a lot of fun to see what randomness I'm be talking about.